Otherwise, Molueni Kikai guys. Hi guys, Njani, how are you? I don't know the other language. Like, <laughs> oh, hundred. Diabolisa. Um. That's what you're saying. Oh, no, it's an old child. Sorry. Oh, child. Sorry. <laughs> there's, there's a lot. 
Talk to me. You mean one I've, I've made or just in general? Well, we can do both. One that I've made. Oh my goodness. So 2020 pandemic, we were watching a lot of Jamie Oliver all the time. 174 <laughs> was just the default channel at home. So um, there was this one dessert with ice cream, dark chocolate, and then you have to cook uh, blueberries and makes this beautiful, delicious, gooey sauce. It sounds exactly like Jamie. Oh! <laughs> you said beautiful, gooey, majestic sauce. That's Jamie. Oh. So, so you you cook you cook the the blueberries and you have some like um, the raspberries. You have some like little bit of strawberry. You have blueberries on the side. Put your ice cream in. Put the berries on. Grate some dark chocolate. Pour on this beautiful blueberry. Oh, it's so good. That's my favorite dessert that I've ever made. Um, you made that for me, please. Yes. <laughs> like, it I sounds shall. so nice. So can you make that for me? I shall. Okay, on your birthday, mm. make it for me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and I'll, I won't be home yet. I'm gonna come you won't? The, no, I'll come at the day after. Damn it. I'll, I'll make for you. Especially, I'll, I'll invite you. Mm-hmm. Make your own special one. Okay, thank and you. Then, yes. Um, favorite that I've had. I mean, I'm not mad at a chocolate cake. Like, oh, you're geez. one of the few people that I know that actually likes chocolate cake. I love chocolate cake and carrot cake, which is hated. Who your hates bitch, carrot your cake? don't have taste. Who hates carrot cake? A lot of people don't like carrot cake. Imagine lacking that much culture. Ew. Um, First of all, on campus, yeah, there was this one store. This lady, she's never nice. <laughs> But it's, if you go to UCT, she used to be at like Lazy Social. Yeah. At the bottom, my good sis, her carrot cake was just... And you always used to be sold up by 12. Yeah. Like there was never... She'd make like I think two or three batches or something like that. That's so the, you had to like... You, know, you had to go before 12. Mm. And because she, she made like a vegetarian, Indian vegetarian food. Mm-hmm. Right, so that vegetarian shit was actually low key fire. Mm. Like I used to have a lot of those stuff, especially like the vegetarian meatballs and all that stuff. Her shit was actually really good. It was just her; she had a stank attitude. The dude she worked with, he was really nice, but her, she had a stank attitude. Yeah, was she about, the main? Yeah, something about being old is, just really gets people because <laughs> Magus just had a stank attitude. Yeah. You'd be like, "Thank you," and she just moves on. You're like, oh shit, god damn, <laughs> nothing. Anyways, but she had great food, and her yeah. carrot cake was probably the best I've ever had. And I used to have that shit all the time when I had money. There's, there's that. <laughs> there's that. You just knew about. Okay, you can only go by, but by one o'clock it's gone. Anyways, mm. carry on. Oh, also honorable mention were the Chelsea buns from our high school. Okay. Gorgeous, delicious. Until they they like racked up the prices, changed the ingredients a little bit, and then yeah, trash. But uh, that grade eight to grade ten period. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. You guys used to eat it every day. I'm like, first of all, I'm, I'm talking about your diabetes. Because <laughs> you guys used to eat that shit every day. And I'm like, there's, there's no way. And I still had lunch. <laughs> but it was also six rand, so. Yeah. Six? Was it six? Well, when it was still affordable, yeah. 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 Well, then, those those times, I, I literally never used to take lunch to school. Why? Money. Oh. <laughs> oh. My bad. Buying that much bread every day. I mean, mm. like, buying that much bread per week was a lot. And also, I didn't have anything to put in it. Yeah. You know? So, I would eat a lot in the morning and eat a lot in the evening. And just have a gang load of water. Yeah. But also, after a while, you get used to it. So you don't even get hungry anymore. Yeah. Then, on occasion, I'd have money. I mean, look, when you don't have money, you get used to a lot of stuff. Yes, Listen. You get used to a lot of stuff. <laughs> I've learned many, many years. <laughs> you get I, used to a lot of stuff. You get used to a lot of shit. I think I would have, I would have had Ipapa every day except for the fact that I had to cook it. So I just oh. end up having bread and, and coffee because uh, cereal is too much milk. Yeah. Too much milk. Even if you dilute it with water, which by the way, I didn't know. Do you, do you do that? We used to do that. Yeah. Even if you dilute the milk with water, it's still not going to last as long as if you just had coffee. Nice. If you just had coffee every day and with peanut butter on your bread, you're good. Yeah. Um, but it's, stop talking about my poverty. Let's, <laughs> let's go. Talk about desserts. Stop triggering the people. <laughs> um, I, um, besides the carrot cake, mm-hmm. I like ice cream. Ice cream is so good. I really do like ice cream. Oh it just does the things for me. And also mm. chocolate. Like top deck chocolate to be specific. Do you want to say that Tin Roof is a little bit overrated? 
just a little it works for me i mean it, it's it's an ice cream it's an ice cream but yeah it works for me i mean i've because now i'm like let me since i don't do much with my life let me spoil myself by buying all the ice creams i wanted as a kid yeah <laughs> <laughs> and i could never afford yeah the other week i bought um so earlier this year i bought a rollo ice cream oh okay which is really good but the one I bought last week was, you know, those the the Cadbury slab, the caramel one. Yes. Yeah. For those who don't know, there's like a Cadbury chocolate with like caramel liquid inside. Mm. But there's like a chocolate form of that. I mean, yeah, ice cream. <laughs> an ice cream, <laughs> an ice cream yeah. form of that. I had that like a couple of weeks ago. I literally finished it in one sitting. Oh my goodness! It sounds it sounds like it's really good. I've never had that. We used to always buy um, the vanilla. My parents and well, the rest of my family really love rum and raisin. I knew it. Disgusting. I the blacks. The blacks Disgusting. Love. Why do black people love that shit so much? Yes, yes. it was. I went home um, earlier this year and they had rum and raisin. And mm. I'm like, and I was like, try it. You haven't had it in years. Maybe you'll like it now. Ew. Rum and raisin. And I, I can deal with the Napoleon one. Napoleon's mm. a vanilla, strawberry, green one. I don't know what the green flavor is. Green? Yeah, where it's like in one thing, where it's like striped. No, it's it's pink. It's your pink. Yes, it's, it's strawberry, white. chocolate, white. and vanilla. No, but there's one where it's green instead of chocolate. Oh, interesting. There is one. Um, uh, ice cream and chocolate is where I'm at, really. Um, but you know, good brownie will always do the yes. things for me. A good yes. brownie. Um, talking about sober brownies. <laughs> yeah, and I really want to taste. I really. <laughs> I really want to taste this thing you're talking about from Jamie Oliver. I I have the recipe on my phone. Mm. I will I will do it for you. I just need to buy the. Um. Yeah. I mean, pretty much it for me. Um. So that was random. So I don't even know why I asked that. But that that was so random. <laughs> but I kind of segues into the topic for today for me, really, because desserts always make you feel good, right? Of course. So, like, what other things do you do? that make you feel good like what is your self-care routine Mm. what sort of thing you do to unwind and be like let me pull myself towards myself and be human again so in general i'm generally in a state of distress (laughs) so i take my moments when i can recently i have discovered masks Oh my goodness! I tried oh, this. Uh, oh, um, I oh, you, I said a mosque. I'm like, wait, you converted? No. What the hell happened here? A mosque, but not like yeah. COVID nineteen mask. I mean, like facial mm-hmm. salon type mask. Uh-huh. I was, I, I got this um, one from Sobe. I mm. uh, sold at Clicks, the charcoal one. And like, it's not that it does you feel anything, but just the placebo effect. Of having a mask and like having had years of media influence. <laughs> it just felt really calming to have it on, even if it was like that 20 minutes. So I really enjoy that. Um, um, I also really enjoy like washing my hair. Although it is a chore and I know it's something I have to do every week. Washing my hair is one of my favorite things. Um, especially if I have to condition Nike. I care. Yo, let's make it a day, bro. <laughs> I don't know what it is about that. But like just cleanliness, um the face masks. Um what else? You tell me. <laughs> I mean I know that I do have to do things that are more I don't know, for future self in terms of like money and setting boundaries and all these things fuck that <laughs> bitch responsibility and therapy but i mean for now <laughs> i mean i do also sometimes well more than sometimes indulge in the green leaf which is it's mm-hmm. fun you know mm-hmm. it's very calming beautiful and... beautiful herb <laughs> it's for those of you that partake i yeah I'm so happy for you <laughs> <laughs> like edible other gaseous <laughs> gaseous forms it's it's really enjoyable you can go today if you want. today let's go i'm ready <laughs> you want to go today i'm down <laughs> okay that's what you know i'm finishing all my money we're, we're hinging on the fact that the mama's gonna pay me back oh okay <laughs> good luck to you <laughs> good luck so we can go that's okay, fine cool. um 
Let's just finish this. Well, what time they close? Half past nine. Okay. 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 <laughs> 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 this is a trash show. Wait, Producing. I didn't bring my card. Oh, unless I can pay you back, like today. Okay. Okay, cool. Thanks. <laughs> I'm excited. Okay. Anyway, <laughs> um, in terms of like, I know I need to go to therapy. I know that. I know I should probably go back on medication. <laughs> First of all, let's just talk about the fact that we're going to a restaurant and self care. Let's start there. Anyway, keep going. Let's go. <laughs> keep going. I know I need to get back on medication, but at the same time, like... Do you, though? I mean, in terms of, like, the busyness of my mind, yes. Because I remember the first time I went on medication, it was so quiet. <laughs> like, I remember talking about outside. I don't know, I know. And I have the same thing, I know. Just mental silence. Oh, my goodness. Mm. I, I was so shocked. I was like, this is how you're living? Like... I don't know that life either. So I, 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 <laughs> so just, it's hard for me to say like, yeah, no, I don't know it either. I've been talking a lot in my head. Y'all bitches. Y'all non-mentally ill bitches. I fucking hate you. <laughs> but yeah, that just that mental clarity is very nice. But yeah, that's what I like doing. I also enjoy the outdoors, um, even though I don't really leave the house that much. But yeah. I would go hiking on a flat surface. <laughs> <laughs> Problem about Cape Town is that you, every time you hike, you have to go up a fucking mountain. Everything is, is yeah. You're just like, fuck, dog. <laughs> <laughs> what about you? Um, I'm, you know, I asked that question because I really have not gotten it down yet. Mm. Anything that I, I mildly enjoyed outside of school and work, I've lost the list for. Mm. So, primarily because I was busy, and when you time you get home, you just, like, sleep. And then weekends are like, okay, all the shit that I need to fix for the week. Yeah. Uh, all the things, like, even now, this morning, I was running around and stuff like that. Has to be done in these two days. So, the most you can give yourself is, let me sleep in. Basically. You know, and wake up at, like, 10. Which is my self-care, because I love sleeping. And having 8 to 10 to 15 hours of sleep <laughs> is, to me, yeah, just wonderful. Um, I don't know how does. I, I, like, I used to, I mean, I still, I, I really do want to get back into, like, finishing the music projects I've started. Because mm. that's self-care to me because it's, it's like the way you were saying you have a lot of noise in your head. Mm. For me, that was the way of flushing it out. Because mm. I could put it, you know, pen to paper or you know finger to phone <laughs> <laughs> that's a good one yeah um and that that to me was my form of self-care because it was a, a way to take out all the busyness that's in there i don't know like i really want to get back into that mm. um i really thought i was going to be that hand that cooked a lot and tried recipes and all that stuff i really did think that until i started working and i was like nah no <laughs> We're like, nah. Cooking every night? What? I'm a meal prep, and You cook me on Sunday, so I'll see you on Friday. <laughs> yeah. Um, I don't know. Ooh. For me... Actually, can we go tomorrow? Tomorrow, no? Yeah. Okay. Because I'm just thinking I have some things to finish. So, <laughs> tomorrow's going to be a better case scenario. Okay. But I have to get back here very quickly. Yeah. And then meet you there. And let's just hope I get some stuff done. But then... You bring it. Are you going to you gonna take it from the, the restaurant? Then? No, you're going to come here. We're going to be from here. Oh, okay. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> that took me a while. It's okay. You know, the thing about being slow is that... Fuck <laughs> <laughs> you. It happens to everyone once in a while. Thank you. Let's not make it harder to edit this. <laughs> <laughs> Let's continue the conversation. Oh, I can tell um, the producer right now just hates our guts. I'm so sorry. <laughs> she hates our guts right now. Like, I wish you guys would stay on topic. Fuck. We get the note. We know before you even give us the note. We know it. We fucking know it. I, I'm sorry. I don't know about you, but I'm sorry. I don't know if I am, but I am, I guess. Anywho. Um, I, so, yeah. Yeah. Go. No. Hmm? Hey. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I hate you. So, um, for me, I feel like 
if if it wasn't for the threat of gaining weight, yeah. eating and trying new food, or like if I had the budget to as well, just restaurant hopping. Oh, I really want to get into that. I, yeah. Once the budget is looking like a budget, like an actual budget, and not this cock. <laughs> I thought I would be doing that yeah. a lot this year, but it didn't happen. It, we're, we're hopping from KFC to KFC. <laughs> Basically. That's what we're doing. KFC, Gatsby's, Burger, Ma- McDonald's <laughs> if we're feeling frisky. I got oh, a, I tried gosh. Burger King for the first time this year. I was like, mm. oh, goddamn. Was it nice? Mm. Oh, God, mm-hmm. interesting. This is one burger. It's humongous, but it's so meaty and cheesy, and it's just tastes like cholesterol and i love it it just tastes like it tastes like cholesterol problems and i just love it also getting older i've got a lot of acid reflux lately so oh no oh no so there's that that does stop Uh, it then um yes now that i'm older i've noticed also that alcohol just generally doesn't agree with me Mm. um as much as it used because i noticed once i have a certain amount of drinks i just start crying mm. i just get very emotional oh please let me never go out of you i'm, I'm i haven't drank in a while okay so. well we, when we go out we're gonna have a milkshake one drink doesn't hurt come on i'm having a milkshake you one can... drink does i'm not gonna drink but you, you can drink go for it i'm gonna have a milkshake <laughs> i think once i have like three four five drinks then i get Okay, I'm not paying for all that. <laughs> no, no man. Um, I do want to. I do want to get in, like, go out more, like walks and stuff, like explore mm. the city more. We did do that a little bit. Yeah. Um, but I think probably just kicking up, kick it up a notch. I do think maybe not having a car does restrict you a little mm. bit, but you can actually go to a lot of places on the bus. So yeah. I mm, you know just go around. Yeah, I would say restaurant hop when you get there, but you know some of these places in Cape Town is just not feasible. Yeah, um, not realistic. Yeah, so, yeah. um, because like um, yeah, if you want to have like a proper like meal and dessert, you're looking at upwards of like two fifty, three hundred. I like, get a nice, not a nice place, but like a good. Decent place. Mm. I'm like more of like a hundred rand on fifty type girl. <laughs> um, I I can do two hundred if it includes yeah. drinks. My my drink is is a dessert because it's milkshake always. <laughs> Love that. <laughs> yeah. Love that. But also like with food, I have an unhealthy relationship. <laughs> No, so do I. Oh man, because it's either unhealthy or it's a binge or it's unnecessarily expensive. So I concur in all three. <laughs> but what other things in terms of self care do you indulge in? I don't even know if I indulge in anything. Really, for me, it's like I spend my day thinking about very complex things. Yeah. And trying to solve things or trying to match things or just trying it's very complex right yeah. it's a very brain intensive job that i have and so i try to watch things that aren't i try to watch things that don't stimulate my brain too much yeah things that are very i don't want to say mindless but things that are innocent like it wouldn't light up on the sky <laughs> Yeah. yeah things that are just very this light like i'll watch a cooking show or watch yeah. a renovation show or um if i watch like a, a serious show like a crime show or a procedural it's something that i know it's routine like okay. i know how this is going to end i know how this is going to go i know what they're going to do like i don't want to think too much with it that's like it's mm-hmm. intense you know what i mean because life is intense for me and i don't like thinking 24 7 i do want to note also, as someone who watches a lot of true crime, mm-hmm. that um, apparently it is very weird to calm down or to <laughs> to relax to true crime. Awkward. I mean, I, I get it. Are we psychopaths? Mm, no, no. Okay, good. No. Are we sociopaths? No, no. Okay, do we have some level of psychopathy? No, not at all. So then what's weird about it? Your murder... <laughs> Are we sadists? No. 
No, I, I don't enjoy it. Okay. Um, I would not massacre see that, not that. Um, I think it's just curiosity more. Yeah, so then what's... Mm. Everybody calm down. People need to calm the fuck down. We hide. Uh, I'm not training myself to kill someone. Relax. I'm not planning anything. This is not. If it happens, my nigga, I'm sorry. I didn't plan it. Speaking about that, I was actually watching this other true crime video. Mm. Um, This lady was a nurse. And she was at an old age home. And she was like injecting some patients with insulin. Mm-hmm. One by one dropping like that. I think she killed like eight people. Yeah, I think I know what you're talking about. British in Canada. Oh, Canada. Yes, Canada. Canada. Yes. Yeah, it's uh-huh. old. And then I she walked into lady. the she walked into the to the police station. She told her therapist. Mm, yes. And then she, then she walked to the police station and confessed. Yes. But apparently, like, she was telling everybody her friends. She told her pastor. She told everybody, and no one was no one was taking her seriously. That's weird. That's scary. Trude, trude, trude. Yeah, but like people, people are really. Anyway, this is not about people. This is about self care, doing your thing. Oh, you know what I really want to be? I want to get to the point where it's like I'm doing black girl self care, where I'm doing yeah, got the facial thing on. I've got my hair in a fucking situation, protective style. You know, yeah. and I'm I'm listening to Erica Badu with some incense, burning candles. You know, burning <laughs> candles. I really want to get some candles. I don't need yeah. them. But I feel like because I have like light sensitivity, mm-hmm. I should actually get candles and just switch off everything. You should. Candles, especially the scented candles, they have a lot of nice ones at Mr. Price. Oh, okay. Um, I had a... Maybe. Um, not more than 50 rand. Like the... the... You bet you should tell me what I bought it today. I didn't know that you were in the candles. I've never seen you with candles, so I didn't assume... I didn't think that you'd like candles. This is what happens when you assume you make an ass out of you. Yo! <laughs> Oh, this is not school, thanks. I remember um, the first time I heard that was in grade five. <laughs> the teacher was like, trying to make a point. He was like, You guys are not serious. I heard that in grade seven as well. <laughs> yeah. And I was like, You can't say that you're a teacher. <laughs> <laughs> I was I was really swearing in my head though I never swear oh. I never swear out loud until grade eight like once I got to grade Same. eight I was like well <laughs> here we go Stop this because I never used to swear out loud like I used to keep it in shout to rap music but <laughs> I think that also you know when a song plays um, on the radio and you're in the car with your parent or something you just know when to mm, yeah true that true that <laughs> yeah. Um, but yeah, I feel like because when I'm obviously you guys, when you're listening, you can't see. But in my place, I try to keep the light that's on as far away from me as possible, so it would okay. be that one, yeah, or that one. It would never really be this one that's here, and I definitely would never switch on if there if there was one here. Yeah, <laughs> I would never yeah. switch on. But the candle situation is starting to sound really sexy. You should get candles. There's a lot of different scents. Um, I had a vanilla one and I had a magnolia one. There's also a grass one as well. So if you're in a grass, get a grass candle. Mm. That was my um, wrist clicking from my old age. Uh, (laughs) Not me being older. (laughs) (laughs) Probably a couple of months. Seven. Wow. It is seven months. That was quick. <laughs> <laughs> I've calculated. You, you, you've been thinking about it. Yeah. <laughs> That's a whole premature pregnancy. Wow, <laughs> okay. You really could have been made the night I was born. Oh and then my, been born. Oh my goodness. And then been born on your birthday. Uh, my sister was premature. No? No, she was over. Over you. She stayed over. Then you? No, I was on time. Oh, that's nice. I was a planned baby. I was on time. I was within the marriage. <laughs> <laughs> the bed was undefiled. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. I was unplanned. I was uh, in the marriage. I was unplanned, though. Yeah. I just came out the world. No shame to my mom. Like, I'm just kidding. <laughs> mom, I love you. Like, ain't no, ain't no shaming in this no one. Shame, We're just, man. the jokes, they gotta fly first. Listen, I'm a whore. It's okay. <laughs> I hope your mom never hears that. <laughs> Cause it's true. <laughs> I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm playing. I'm playing. I really, no, nah, I'm really am. Okay. Cause really, you're not. I've, I've heard no, I'm, worse. I'm not a, yeah. I'm not a whore. I'm just, you know, stepping stones. And I'm pretty sure I'd be worse. <laughs> <laughs> so <laughs> I got no foot to stand on. Um, what's that? Self care. Oh. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Another thing I really like. Um, at some point during the year. 
I get this feminine urge to do my nails. So it's actually, I mean, of course. You do your nails and then you DJ with your nails <laughs> to get the full effect. <laughs> it feels nice, but shut up. <laughs> um, I just, I go and get like this ridiculous, um, manicure. almost can't type on my laptop manicure. And it just feels nice. It feels nice to be extra. Hold my phone a certain way. I like you. You've seen this. No, I, no, it is. It's definitely like it's definitely like the. Yeah. And you can't hold it. And you type like this with the bottom of your finger. Yes. And like, and then you just. Yes. This is your typing. You just it's like you play the bongo drum. <laughs> Which if you don't start typing properly, I feel like that's actually one thing. Like hair, face routine, mm-hmm. and nails. Because I've got the heels part down. <laughs> It's the Child. it's the hair, face, and um and nails. Like I feel like I would have I got my full actualized form mm-hmm. as a black woman once once I get there. But I just don't have any list for any of those things. Yeah, that's okay, okay though. No, no, it's, it is. I mean, I don't I don't beat my face at all. Yeah, you'll catch me. Not gonna lie, when the first time I heard beat, my, <laughs> yo, I was like, what are you guys going through? <laughs> I was worried. Yeah, no, me too. Because people were like, I got my face beat. I'm like, sorry? <laughs> I think when the first time I heard that, who was, who was that? Was that Tamar? It wasn't even the gays. <laughs> yeah. I think it was just Tamar. I think she could, and the Braxton show. It was a yes, I, I don't know. Braxton Family Values. Because when that, that uh, ooh, you find the English. <laughs> That's when she was doing, like, you know, everything.com everything.org mm. you know when Tamar was doing Tamar things yes I remember I was like oh yes honey she is booked to capacity mm. and she's, like, she's beat for the gods and I'm like okay but then you when you when you expand to social media and all that stuff you realize oh no this has been a thing yeah it's just that she was just saying it. that's how I got introduced to it yeah yeah um yeah that's what 2012 something like that whenever Damn. the Whenever the Braxton's came out of the thing. That's such a long time ago. This is nine years ago. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, you know you want me back. Yeah. You gotta need me. You gotta want me back. Wow, wow. Okay. So I, <laughs> <laughs> we had to finish it though. It was, you can't leave that hanging, you know. You, you just gotta. Anyways. <laughs> It's a full set. You can't. <laughs> Anyways, but also another self care thing that I would do once I'm rich is buy sneakers. Mm. It makes me feel good. You've been doing that though. <laughs> but I haven't bought sneakers in multiple years. Like the last time before, I bought these techies. These are on your marks techies that I bought this year. This they are. Before that, I think it was 2019 that I bought. You had a sneaker dealer even at some point. Yeah, but I'm pretty sure the nigga was sending me fake shit. But can you tell it's fake? S- no, some of them are really good, but some of yeah. them it's like, mm, I don't know, bro. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so last time I got sneakers, that was sneaker sneakers, was my graduation gift. Mm-hmm. But I only got it because I pressured my mom. <laughs> and they were half <laughs> price off. Yeah. There was like literally an hour on Superbulous, and they're like 50% off sneakers. And you were like, Mom! I literally called I said, Mama, I'm telling you right now, you can buy this for 3000 or you can buy this for 1.5. You pick. <laughs> and she gave me the 1.5 and then yeah. I bought the two pairs. It was this, the, the, the Air Forces and the, the campuses, the, mm. the Adidas. But um, I really genuinely want a full wall of just sneakers. Just the idea of buying it feels good. Yeah. But food for me... <laughs> Food. Oh, food. food. Restaurant, oh. restaurant hopping and, and buying from restaurants and Ubering eats. <laughs> Ooh, when we're back home, I know Angelo's is not a fine establishment. No, we have to go. <laughs> but there's this one burger that I had. I don't know if they still have it, but it was a, a fig and brie uh, cheese burger. Me, Monday. I don't remember. I wasn't paying. <laughs> we're not with family. But it, weirdly enough, it made so much sense. So uh, uh, the fig and brie, especially if the fig is like a jam type situation, it's very it sweet. Was, it it's was. very sweet, and the brie works for me. I can see that flavor it with was the beef. Good with the beef. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yep, works for me. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. 
But yeah, that's um. We gotta do the self care, guys. I encourage you guys to do something because I, I, as somebody who's future oriented in wow, there's no English today. That one, that word, <laughs> yes. Future oriented, <laughs> yes. I tend to oversave. I tend to stri- constrict my my spending. Mm. Um, and I'm trying to get to the point where I can save what I want to save and also enjoy life. Go out when I want to go out. Try yeah. something new on Uber Eats or go to a restaurant. Um, just trust. It's for me. I'm not. I'm not there yet. Yeah. Hopefully, in a couple of years, I can definitely do that. I can see that happening. Yeah. Um, but um, yeah. It's it's a bit it's a bit tough because it's important and I, and I can tell that it's it takes a toll when you don't do it because you just feel like you're in a hamster wheel that doesn't end mm, mm. you know and I'm definitely in a hamster wheel right now I mean even um, you know selfie doesn't really have to be all these expensive things really it could even just be fixing your sleep mm-hmm. um, it could be I don't know what you guys want <laughs> but that's what I'm saying like even yeah. sleeping in or yeah. not you don't have to go to the gym today or like just don't just punish yourself yeah like be like uh, i'm switching off my phone mm. i'm watching tv today fuck everybody else that's a that's a thing and if somebody really wants to get you and something tragic is happening they'll catch you eventually we'll come to you but with the communication of i'm disappearing for a bit y'all bitches let me tell you something <laughs> Nah, I don't. I don't have any beef, but just like you know, just anymore. saying <laughs> uh, anymore. But just saying like, hey, I'm busy. Then fuck off. At least I don't know. Yeah, I don't. I don't know. I'm toxic, so I don't do that. Uh, <laughs> so I'm toxic. I haven't matured that much. But um, yeah. Otherwise, buffets. Let's see you on the other side next week. Same time, same place. Take care of yourselves. Self care is key. Um. Yeah, eat a fruit. E- a Please, for goodness sake, if you expect the people to do some nasty things to you, eat a fruit. Have some water. And drink water. Oh my goodness. Drink water. So. And eat some fruit, some pineapples, some watermelon, some cranberries will go a long way. Yeah. It's just something. Have something. I just think if you just make it a good integral part of your diet, that you're drinking a lot of water at the very least. In Hawaii, orange, yeah. No, go. Just help Sounds us out, mean. is what I'm trying to say. Anyways. Help me help you. <laughs> help me, nigga. Help me. Uh, one more thing, one more thing, one more thing. Like, comment, share, subscribe. Tell uh, us what you like to do for your self-care. Tell us what you want to hear us speak about. Yes. You feel me. Give us a story time. We will read it for you. <laughs> Catch us on Instagreasy. Tweezy. <laughs> Tweezy. Face Beezy. <laughs> meta. It's oh. meta now. Well, the company is meta. Well, oh, I hate I hate the name. But anyway. Bush. Bye. Bush out. <laughs>